Hello Cancer and Crossroaders, welcome to the extended reading for November of this current year for you. Um, Cancer and Crosswatchers, this is for Sun, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, also Saturn, Jupiter, and Mars. So please check your charts if this resonates with you. Yay. If not, boop your nose way, goes. No point about worrying about shit. They got nothing to do with me and none of your damn business. All right, this is the extended reading from your reading that I did for you in November, right? You or your person? What was it? Are you getting played by somebody or some shit? What the fuck was your last reading anyway? Mind you, I just did your reading the other day, so I haven't uploaded it yet, and I haven't thought of a title, but, like, you know, I feel like, mm. I can't remember everything cancer shit. However, the current situation or the person, three of cups scenario with the lady with the bowl, I feel like there's a third party situation. Or some addictions or something that got cut out and like someone's trying to either drink to forget or drink something to help them forget. One of the two, right? Would she be known or aware in the situation? Um, was it y'all that I was talking about hooking? Was it, was it y'all that I was talking about hooking and shit, hookers and such? Cause that's what this one makes me feel like. Someone's like dangling money out for somebody, you know, like you have this if you suck my nee, 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 nee. It's hard to tell with this person, um what the fuck is up with them, I feel like. You know, like this is a person who um there's a lot of duality with this deck, and I feel like this person's journeying into their duality. This person is not. This person's just stagnant. Like you can't tell if this person's on the light side or the dark side. It's like kinda like DPD and shit. You know, going in that black and white thinking sort of thing. But you can't tell what this person's actually doing, how they're reacting, how they're thinking, shit like that. Their energy or the energy of the situation. Someone's waiting not to get decked out by the same sex. I don't know. They don't want to... <laughs> They don't want to fight the person because they know they're going to get their ass beat by someone of the same sex. Definitely could be two men. Who knows why? Um, could definitely be two women too, but it, it, it's definitely someone waiting to see what happens. Is there going to be a fight between us or can they quell it, you know? like Someone's trying to wait out their time so they won't get their ass beat. It's like someone making an apology video on YouTube. They wait a few weeks thinking everyone's going to forget like because a week is like 100 years internet time and then they come out with an apology but then they remind everybody why they were mad to begin with and it would have just been easier just to be gone for a year come back and then like just never address the shit like if you never talk about it at all it's probably better honestly i think you know but this person will just come back and remind a motherfucker uh why they wanted to beat their ass to begin with and you know the desire in the situation with this person um, they keep digging up onions, and they are not sure they should keep digging up onions anymore or not. Like, it's a choice, you know, could you, do you want to dig up some more and cry about it, or what? Because it's not helping them get enlightened one way or another, right? Like, they need to make a choice, Cancer and Cross Watcher, but I feel like they're waiting it out because they don't want to get their ass beat. You're just like, oh, maybe I can make them forget this situation, but it's also like, you know, hey, um... Someone isn't going to keep begging if you can't, like, choose where the fuck you are, you know? So. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. Cancer, you might be, like, stuck in your shell, too, in this situation. You might not even be opening up right now. You're probably in defensive mode. Especially in regards to your feelings. Because this one popped out while I was doing this shit as well. So. Cancer and cross watchers. Let's see. What's their next move in the situation or with this person? Uh, I feel like a fucking child. <laughs> All like, um, tender-hearted, emotional, wearing their heart on their sleeve. I feel like it's, um, but, it, but he's going to, um, help to forget something and waiting something out between, like, getting the ass beat from someone who probably wants, who really is, might be justified in doing so. You know. Uh... What blocks this person? The death card. Ending things. But I feel like they're hesitating. Even though it's upright, even though I think they're aware that this shit needs to end, they're hesitating. 
No. They're pregnant with another opportunity, but that means the other one has to die. It doesn't matter how long that's been there. It doesn't matter if you mother and shit. It's got to go. You can only feed one. You only got enough titty for one. I only see one titty. Thing. She's also kind of sideways, too. Ugh. Be wary of this. Something about family. Be wary of a family. Is someone trying to have a baby with someone after they already have a little kid? Uh, the results of all this, someone's gonna run away. <laughs> someone's running away from this family scenario, too. Cancer and Crosswatcher. Right into this place where they don't know what the fuck's going on and all of their choices are not bringing them the enlightenment they were expecting, I reckon. At least that's what the, makes the most sense to me, anyway. Okay, Cancer, so let's go through this, right? Your next move! They want to be all lovey-dovey. Cancer, that could be you trying to be lovey-dovey, right? Because that's how you do. That's how you do. Because that's how we love you, my boo. Boop, 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 boop. Anyway, so. Cancer and Crosswatchers. Hmm. Ooh, that came out definitely sideways. I'm gonna put that back. This person doesn't know their ass from a, anything. 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 Don't you listen to these motherfuckers, Cancer, because it's like they either lie or are too stupid to know how to lie proper. Um, there is no in between. <laughs> Don't like some black and white things in here. Let's see. Yeah, someone's trying to venture for you with some childlike, immature emotion because they want to take a leap of faith. They know where they're going. I don't, I don't know, man. It's like they're trying to run away from shit. You know, like, not really looking into something either. They're, like, they're not researching what they're jumping into or checking to make sure what they're jumping into is a good idea. Either, just saying. Hmm. Because they're really not committed to the situation, or they just don't want to listen to somebody who is more authoritative than they are. Ugh, what blocks this person cancer on a crosswatch? Death card. Could be with Scorpio, right? They need to end something or something new to begin, but they're blocked by that. It's like they can't do it. Could be something to do with a kid too um you know they know that they are on this horse in a desert and it has no name and they need to deliver this shit eventually but they do feel trapped possibly by an earth sign somewhere it could be capricorn taurus virgo they've turned their back and they're just not interested they're more interested in the sunset you know like you know i'm burning my canaries out every day just to watch the sun but it's better than looking at your face that kind of energy right just being mean unnecessarily because me saying that wasn't even necessary. Oh, that's just kind of rude. So, yeah, that's the energy that person's carrying. Like, they, like being intentionally mean and cruel on purpose. You know, there might have been a mistress who came out of nowhere. Cancer, you might have been the mistress. It could be a Pisces of the mistress. But somebody came out of the woodworks and being like, hey, they like my titties, you know? Then justice got thrown out the fucking window because where is the love? It's not here. Where is it? It's not here. Like, you gotta kill this shit. You gotta end it. But it's like, you know. Someone's attached, but they know that there's no point to be attached. Cancer Crosswatcher. Fuck it. It don't matter. Uh, They run away with shitty words or they just don't say nothing at all. Cowardly, really. They got their sword up, but they're running away, you know. Uh, could be Gemini, Aquarius, Libra involved here. Sorry, there's something in my eyeball. It's actually to the point where it's hurting. I don't know what it is. I think it's an eye. Oh, yeah, it's an eyelash. It's an eyelash. Okay. It's an eyelash. Haha, -ha, I'm going bald on my eyeballs. You know, this person would rather run away than, like, lose the fucking back. 
deserves them as a calorie or they just want to feel like a victor and if they don't feel like a victor it'll be all in their feelings about the shit talking that nonsense like there's a reason for that nonsense and then feeling bad about it after they did it you know keeping themselves stuck in a really shitty situation because like the tower did not come in the way they thought i repeat nothing got fucking burnt two people did not go down and that's really irritating and then they end up using their intuition possibly pisces at some point to realize that um home is where the heart goes you know a home is an investment and i almost feel like they picked one person over the other so that's what i got to say as far as i almost feel bad for this person but it's like they knew better like they knew better than most that's the thing that that's like kind of getting to me a little bit like they, they knew better they knew better than most they knew better than most people yet they're acting like they don't know shit that's ridiculous anyway let's continue oh they don't want to fight someone definitely has a they, like that's a volcano that that's that hey do we really need to do this get on the ground oh you know like you're like klaus <laughs> oh my god i've gotten into the umbrella academy oh my god i like that show i like vanya i feel bad for, well, well i like vanya because she was a violinist anyway who knows if I'll ever get my violin back. I miss it. Uh, at least I got my guitar, so I guess I can't complain. But, still though, it would be nice to get my instrument back. But I like Vanya. Like, she's got the power of sound and music and tone, and I was just like, yeah, okay, that's pretty cool. But yeah, this person doesn't want to fight whoever it is. Like, someone doesn't want their ass beat, and these two are the same sex, too. These are two dudes. So someone definitely, it could be too masculine. Or people with um, man-like tendencies, masculine tendencies, two guys, two dudes. Um, just two of the same kind, just different. But they definitely are of the same um, gender and sex. These all came out sideways. Very, very long standing relationship that's very wavering. Very questionable about how they demonstrate their love and how they deliver that love. Both of these people are kind of like the same people. I think that's why they don't want to fight this person. Why you possibly don't want to fight this person or they don't want to fight you, Cancer Crosswatcher. <sighs> well, this person will definitely throw you the fuck out. <laughs> Like they're looking somewhere else to go get something and another person's going and leaving souvenirs being like, don't ever forget me. Meanwhile, the person's like the person, like one person who's like the page right here. The page here keeps wanting to like leave something for someone to remember them by. This night of here is just like I'm moving out the house. You can have the house. I don't care. I'm gone. While this person's trying to leave mementos and shit. That's the wrong deck. Anyway. Uh, the, 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 be wary of this family right here I feel like someone wants to have a baby with somebody else because there's already a kid here and I feel like one kid's going to get smashed for the other uh, defeat 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 and they're trying to get away from this person who defeated them Cancer and Cross Watcher. I feel like this is going to end up like a bad time for somebody. Like they fell. They fell into something. But I don't know what it is. So. They felt defeated by someone who saw them as dangerous. Could be an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Or this is their desire because they find the other person dangerous. What the fuck does that even mean, Cancer and Crosswatcher? What is, what does that mean? What like why is the person who's the victor over here terrified of the storm? Why is someone looking like someone in this Vanya from the Umbrella Academy? 
who is Vanya from the Umbrella Academy? What is our superpower? You know, like, I felt so bad for Vanya. She had no idea how dangerous she really was. And how many people she genuinely murdered just because they got on your ner on her nerves. Hmm. Oh. Somebody chose somebody. Somebody chose somebody. Who... Ended up being a disaster, and that's who was, the person who was defeated is the disaster. But they're also the person who got picked. So it's like someone dealt with them accordingly. Is that the be wary thing, or are you gonna have to like do that, Cancer and Crosswalk? I'm not sure. We're going to find out. Maybe. Okay, so over here, what is the result of all this? Someone's definitely running away. Still having some attachment here, but leaving the other Seven Cups for the Eight of Cups. There was a lot of unfairness going on. This person could see it, but they didn't want to. Um... It's like, hey, dude's looking at the clouds, but he don't want to make shapes. Like, what's the point of looking at the clouds if you ain't going to make shapes with them? If you're not going to look at the dragons and dinosaurs and the fire-breathing bunnies? You know, what's the point? Uh, unfairness. They lost their temper. They got arrogant, turned their back on shit, just being like, fuck this. I don't need to deal with this. This is illogical and irrational. Even though they're kind of being illogical and irrational with what they're doing, definitely could be dealing with a Libra, especially with the Six of Pentacles here. Also, Gemini and uh, Aquarius. How was the other one? You know. This person like, is now acting patient, though. Like, they turned their back on the shit. Um, despite the fact that they know that there was a lot of unfairness in this, they, they're being patient because they're waiting for a new cycle to start, right? The problem is they're too busy paying attention to the snakes in the yard rather than killing them with the stick they're fucking holding because, you know, that's the reason why you have the stick. I don't give a shit if you're the king. Um, you have a stick. And you have snakes in your yards. Use the stick. Don't stare around and be like, hey, I knew there was stuff in my yard or whatever, right? Um, not really trying to um, deal with decisions that needs to be made because, you know, um, that would require them to care enough to do that, I feel like. Which might come with great change here shortly. Um, like, they have the ability to change things, but I feel like they feel like not doing anything will result in something better. So, let's see. I have used your strength to limit my next... Alright, one more card, Cancer and Cross Watchers, and then you clarify, okay? Okay. So, not mad, they turn their back, they think they, they don't need to handle the shit, they're kind of arrogant in it, blah, 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 all that shit. Um, that's what's got them trapped. That's gonna trap them. It's their trap card. To the shadow realm you go. Mmm. Pride cometh before a fall, huh? That sucks. That sucks a lot. Sure. Let us see and clarify for the and cross watchers. Alright, so what's their next move? Hmm. Oh, my goodness, these kids. <laughs> ah. Hmm. Hands and cross watchers, someone's gonna walk away from somebody abruptly, and that person they walk away from has no idea what the fuck they're gonna do. It could be cancer that's getting walked away from by this person. Like, they come in trying to invite themselves in with their love, their fucking cup with the fish that sticks out of it and says hi, like it's not a puppet or black magic, and then they just walk away out of nowhere. Like, this person has issues with commitment for sure. 
Uh, all confused about how to start something new. Might make your dreams come true and maybe somebody to help it along with it. Lots of confusion here with what this person's doing, Cancer and Cross Watchers. Okay, what blocks them? What the fuck is that? Oh, yeah. Um, they know they gotta end things here or like at least finish something so something new will start, right? But because they aren't like actually putting in the fight to do that. Two people, one definitely acting more mature than the other one, um, separate. One wants to leave mementos, the other one wants to just get a fuck away, because it's like, no, please, no, please stay away from me, I hate you. Like, I'm sick of this shit, I don't even want to remember you. Someone's being harsh, like, with the Queen of Pentacles energy, like I mentioned before. Yeah, this shit's over, someone isn't giving to the situation anymore. The one who is more feminine is the one who is definitely not giving to this situation anymore. You know. Let's see. Yeah, someone's, yeah, no. Like, Cancer Cross Watcher, you're probably just being like, I'm not giving to this. Take your fucking swords. I'm going home. You don't have a paddle. I'll use the, my damn swords and my boat to paddle. There is no parlay, bitch. You know, like. Just done. Ugh. But you will be as gentle as possible, or there's Aaliyah being as gentle as possible, or Sag or Aries, any of them. Someone with fiery energy takes the action to be gentle with their, uh, um, uh, go F yourself, uh, position as it is. It could be this fire sign that's um, throwing the swords down in this situation. They could be the more feminine, even though they're the king of wands. I don't know. So it definitely could be a Leo in that scenario. Just being like, fuck this shit, I'm um. Alright. Uh, da 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 be where I'm uh, a shit magician. That might be the issue here. You might have your magician in play. Cancers or cross watchers. This person. Hmm. Cancer and Crosswatcher, you might have chose this person over and over again. Which I think was a terrible idea, because, you know, at least the redhead, like, she had the energy to kick her leg up. The other version, like, they didn't even take her foot all the way off the ground. This bitch is on her tippy toes, you can't even see the other chick's foot, you know. You might have, you might have chose the lazier of the two, and that person might have, you know... Bit of problem, Cancer and Cross Watchers. Or them, you. Whichever one. Yeah, this motherfucker never wants to, like, actually agree with... Like, they argue to argue. No matter how much, you cannot parlay. Two cards of my parlay. Nobody wants to parlay. Nobody wants to actually debate, discuss, or anything like that, right? This person purposely causes issues... Just to have an argument with someone, because it's like they feed off that shit. It's like, how, that's how they show their love. They'll break your TV and then buy a new one, and that's how they show their love. Which is ridiculous, you know, you shouldn't be going that far. That's because they got their own problems they can't get over either. This could be somebody who keeps doing dumb shit. Causes the same issue, causes the same infrastructural problems, and doesn't want to, like, actually have a discussion with people about the the issue at hand. But then, ha and then, and then has the audacity to be like, oh, well, I feel really bad about this. I just can't dump my cup out because it, it was a terrible thing for me to take. I'm like, bitch, please. Like, you fucking care now. <laughs> like, if you cared, you wouldn't have never done the shit to begin with, you know? Well, I don't know, because people do dumb things all the time, you know. But uh, it'd be different if you did this shit the first fucking, or even second, or third time. After the 15th? Uh, excuse me. You know, how many times are you going to do the same thing before you start realizing that you are the problem and fix that problem, you know? 
All right, what is the results of all of this? Cancer and cross watchers. Someone's unfairness. Someone doesn't even want to fucking like admit that they're unfair. It's like, no, 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 no. I'm completely in the right, but you know that's not right to say that, don't you? That's what's got this person trapped, right? Anything that, like anything they say in here is just gonna send them off. This is like a counterpart for sure. Whatever this person hears, even if it's from the grapevine, it's just gonna wanna make them wanna fight somebody. The King of Wands, though, he's trying to be gentle with his telling somebody to fuck off. This bitch over here, she's just here and shit and ready to throw down. You know. Ready to throw down because there isn't love here. Someone just whispering in someone's ear like, I don't love you or I don't want you. That's what I, that's all I heard. That's what I heard. Someone's looking for a secret cancer and cross watchers. This is your card too. Like someone's whispering in someone's ear about a lack of love. And then someone comes looking for secrets or something. Yeah, someone's just coming up wanting to know some shit just to bother another mother. Like, this person, this person comes looking for a secret just so they can bug you with them. It's like someone, um, trying to act like your friend. Just so they can go and tell all your other friends your secrets, you know. They bring bad health. Bad juju. And honestly, I don't think you should be dealing with them cancer and cross vultures, you know? Because, like, this person is just... They are all fucked up. They are just something else, you know? There's no new start for this person, that's for sure. They, like, it, even if there was, they can't complete it. They wouldn't try to, uh, finish the goal or whatever. They come out of guard... And actually be committed. Ooh, these things are flying. Because um, they're very much not happy in their situation. and But they're also not happy about the fact that they got to commit, too. Even though they know that's what they got to do. Like, you, you can't be going one place to another, man. You can't just be zip-zopping everywhere or called every place home. Like, that's, that's kind of unstable. I mean, unless that's, like, your job or something, then that could be your stability. Well, I mean, you can make anything stable. You can make anything comfortable, right? But still, it's like, um... Like, you know, how many baby mamas you got around, like, around fucking town that you gotta have a house with, you gotta have an address with. Like, you, you have an address for everything. You have an address for your sports issues magazine, you have an address for your, um, video games coming, you have an address for your bills, you have a P.O. box, like, you know, how many addresses you need? Why don't you want nobody to find you, you know? Oh, okay. Oof. This. This emperor right here is a uh, masculine feeling dude. He's angry. So is the empress, but it's like whoever this is, they know that something isn't starting, and that's what's angered them. And they were trying to open up and figure out what the hell happened. Um, looking over here at her, and she's upset because she knows she's got to keep promises. Whoever this female is. Whoever this person is, anyway. Hmm. Anyway, Cancer Crosswatcher, that's been your extended read for November. So, love y'all's faces. You take care of yourselves. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye.